every single person has a feminine trait and a masculine trait it's just sometimes you have to pick and choose the more dominant one and for the girlies that want to be feminine women and want all their life every single aspect of their life to reflect that this video is for you Popping besties, it is your girl Pascaline, and I am back with another YouTube video. Now, if this is the first time you are seeing my face, hello, my name is Pascaline, and I make lifestyle content, a lot of self development content, and really entertaining vlogs. I hope you subscribe and stick around to be part of the family because on this side of YouTube, we really care about self development and growth in general. So, let us get straight into today's video. So, femininity is about expressing yourself in the way that is true to you okay it is not a one size fits all i always say this femininity is not a one size fits all it's never about putting you in a box it's just about this is for the girlies that just always always want to feel feminine that feminine that want to live in their femininity that want to bask in their femininity okay i'm a feminine woman and i want every single aspect of my life to reflect that so today that is what i'm going to be telling you guys just some really micro habits things that people oftentimes overlook but they just help you always feel feminine so micro habit number one is for you to embrace leisure guys my loves you do not always have to be on the go okay you do not always have to look sick for the next thing to do the next thing to occupy your time embrace leisure like love the fact that you you're just relaxing love the fact that you're just taking out time to read love the fact that you're just taking out time to do your skincare love the fact that you spend extra time doing things that people eh, people might consider to be useless things like doing your skincare i don't i think some people would consider doing your skincare useless but just embrace leisure don't beat yourself up if you're not doing something all the time you don't always have to be on the go it's good to be on the go but also have time that is intentionally created for you to just bask in relaxation because honestly even when god was creating the world listen women were we were never supposed to always be on the go even biblically okay so find time to relax and be taken care of and just accept care okay let me just get into this too bask in your femininity to bask in your femininity you also have to be very willing and very open to receiving care but i think i talked about it in my other femininity video and if you haven't seen that video you definitely should i would link it up here so go check that out habit number three that i think is so cute and is just something that i feel like every woman that is on her femininity journey should be doing is on her self-love journey should be doing is like matching on this like literally matching your bra to your panties like matching lingerie your lingerie is is for you is for you guys you're not showing anybody you're not taking pictures in this but it's for you so you know it just makes you feel so confident and so good knowing that girl like under all of this i still look bomb i still look good i don't know it just does something to me i don't know how i don't know if it's just me but if you if you know what i'm talking about please leave it in the comment section but matching on this matching like matching sets yes guys so this is a micro habit that just helps me feel ultra feminine okay like whenever i just look at myself in the mirror i'm like that girl you know yeah so like invest in like really good lingerie honestly guys you don't need to have a man to do any of this do it for yourself do it because you look at yourself in the mirror and say girl 
yes so guys the next one right after the matching on this is like really cute loungewear like having really cute loungewear having like really cute pajamas making sure that you're not just wearing anything when you're at home this is just going to make you feel good all the time okay it's just going to make you feel good all the time when you like wake up you have your bath even if you work from home like i do i like to when i wake up have my bath put it like put on pajamas although it's pajamas or loungewear put on pajamas or really cute loungewear and just lounge around and coming from somebody that really does not go out as much and i have more out indoor clothes than i have outdoor clothes cute loungewear will just always always elevate my mood always it just makes you feel like okay yeah i'm ready i'm ready for my day i'm ready to start my day you know so that's a micro habit that you should like incorporate into your life because it just makes you feel feminine all the time okay all the freaking time you look good all the time the next thing is for you to always 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 smell good guys you don't have to be going out to smell good you need to have scents that you associate with yourself that is just for you you are when you are at home and it's just a scent that your fr is probably only your friends know about that you're just you, this is how i smell at home okay just you need to always smell good and i want to do i think the next video i am going to be posting is going to be on how to always smell how to smell good all the time regardless of the time the day because it is so important guys it is so important smelling good is so important and it just makes you feel so good not just smelling good is not just about your perfume it's from the shower routine it's from the environment you are in it's from what you're wearing which i am going to touch on in a smelling how to always smell good video but guys make sure you're always smelling good at home make sure you have candles diffusers all of those things that air fresheners that just that makes your house homely and just makes it like a, a relaxation area like you don't need to be outside to relax your house your abode should definitely be somewhere that is cozy and you enjoy being in okay so just make sure you smell good and your environment smells good that is also a micro habit that you should incorporate into your life okay guys the next thing is to have things that reflect your personality in your room okay like as you guys can see i have like this bookshelf guys the story of this bookshelf is so funny and this was not what i ordered but you know but yeah i have this bookshelf at my back i love to read and you guys know i love to read so that's a big part of my personality and if you guys can look can look by this side you would see there's a picture right there up there okay and that's a picture of mr park jimin whom i love very much thank you and yeah just having things that just reflect your personality or like show who you are or just gives a little bit of insight of who you are in your room is just always a good idea i know you might be wondering how is this thing going to make you feminine but trust me trust me trust me if you go into a man's room you are going to know if you go into a house that has been decorated by a man you are going to know and that is not what you want as somebody that is trying to be a feminine woman that is trying to bask in her femininity next thing is to drink more water I know I know I know what well, everybody should drink more water not just feminine people but not everybody is going to drink more water out of a really cute flax so just like this thing I carry this to the gym it just makes me drink more water I recommend that you have like a flax that is cute that you I and I change this top all the time like I get new ones I have a lot of them and I just switch them and change them and just make it look cute and then carry it to the gym and carry it to everywhere that I'm going to it is just so cute and it is just so sweet because yeah it's just one of those things that just makes you more girly I don't I don't mind but there was a, there was a time that people would be like that if people told me oh you're such a girly girl and I'll be like no 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 yes I am a girly girl okay so just have those little cute things that are just like creams woman you know just just little things that are just cute 
all right so that every single thing you are doing every single thing you are touching just screams femininity just screams woman just screams girly girl okay if you're really trying to be bask in your femininity i feel like you should try and just have things around you that just remind you that actually i'm just a girl i'm just a girl at the end of the day (laughs) do girly things okay do the things that are considered girly the things that people will say oh that's such a girly things to girly thing to do yes i'm just a girl those, those things are not cringy like especially if you enjoy doing them those things are not cringy i was talking to somebody and he was like oh k-dramas are for girls and i was so disgusted because like how is k-dramas just for girls but i couldn't care less i'm just a girl after all okay so do girly things things that people would consider girly yes those things do them all right the next micro habit is for you to compliment others honestly sincerely in this is a safe space type of way i'm going to tell you guys i'm not used to complimenting men i'm not i'm like it's not something that just comes naturally to me but i i'm trying I'm, tr- I'm honestly just trying but when it comes to like women i love complimenting women like i love it like it gives me so much joy because i know how much joy i get whenever like i get a compliment from a woman so guys compliment people compliment women compliment men just be somebody that puts a smile on another person's face okay that is basically it um i think that's the end of this video guys um i think i shared a lot of habits that you can just micro habits that you can just do here and there here and there you know that is not really that deep but you just can do if you can do it okay so just take this video with a pinch of salt and do not read too much into it trust me it is not that deep take the information that you need do not take the information you do not need that's basically very light-hearted don't i'm not saying you should become somebody else or that you should conform to societal standards that is one thing i get sometimes that is not really the point i'm just helping the girlies that want my help so yeah that is the end of today's video guys if you enjoyed this video please give me a thumbs up and if you have some micro habits that you do that just help you help you feel more feminine please let me know because i would absolutely absolutely love to start doing them that is the end of today's video guys do not forget to like comment and subscribe to be part of my bestie gang because my bestie gang is lit and i would see you in another video guys i love you so 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 much Bye besties.